All right, so I thought I would start off with, this is the, I would say the 10th or uh, 20th of my latest finds, which is uh, CSI Deadly Intent. Let's put that over here. So if any of you ever uh, tried Hellfire, from the Diablo series, you know how ridiculous that guy with the cow armor can be. This right here is like my, oh, I don't know, third or fourth copy of uh, Diablo that I've picked up through random encounters. Get it? Random encounters? Oh, yeah. Real Deal Casino Championship. Fantastic game. I was concerned about this one, but uh, not only does it work on my computer, but it works really well on my computer. So there, there, there you have it. Pretty uh, awesome game to say the least. I got the the book for this bad boy, and uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Look at that. Yeah, kind of looks like a uh, a ball headed uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger or something. Nah, nah. I think his bicep would be, would be bigger. But based on that sword, you know, it's kind of, you know, Conan-ish, I suppose. All right, let's open up the box. Let's see what's in here. All right, hold on. Give me some, give me some room here. All right. Hold on a second. Because this stupid thing... There we go. All right, here we go. So, we got Mall Tycoon 2, the deluxe edition. Come on, focus. There we go. We also got Kingpin, which has a very interesting... Uh, thing to it because this is the soundtrack used on this game is from Cypress Hill. And of course, who can forget Oregon Trail, the fifth edition. This is the more uh, cartoonish and very easy version of Oregon Trail. We got Feath, the Dark Project. Here's one of my favorites. Big Game Hunter. See that bear right there? Yeah, got to hunt bear. That's right. Anyone who knows me knows that I love to hunt bear in the Oregon Trail. And this I picked up for like a dollar at a thrift shop. So I thought this was pretty cool. And there's whatever the hell this one is. It's kind of like Descent. Uh, Zepior. Zepior? Zepior? However the hell you say that. Pretty interesting. Ah, here we go. One of my favorites. Pac-Man and the Adventures of Time. Classic. And, uh... Here is Decipher, Disciples Sacred Lands. A rather, uh, this, this version of Oregon Trail, I, uh, was not able to get to function on my newer computer. Kept glitching out. Some stupid error, so, uh, I don't know. I'll get it to work sooner or later. Now, WWF, WrestleMania, the arcade game. Yeah, I wonder if this would be worth anything more if I could get, like, you know, Scott Hall and everybody else to uh, autograph it. Who knows? My other copy of Diablo, of course. And, uh, hold on, there we go. Diablo 2. 
Uh, here we go with Starfleet Academy Strategic Command. Uh, Sniper Pain of Vengeance. And this is the uh, Star Trek Voyager Limited Edition Utility. Not a game per se, but uh, a rather interactive uh, CD with, you know, Voyager things in there. And last but not least, for the first box, Perils of... Deaths of Peril, which uh, is a pretty interesting uh, combination of rogue elements and Diablo elements. So not a not bad at all. That's my first shoebox. And like I said, this is like 95% of my collection. So there we go. Get that right there. All right. You know what? Maybe I can... Hold on a second. Let me see that. Fit the book there. And maybe I can... All right. Uh, nope, the book is not going to work. Okay, but that's that's this box. Now, let's uh, grab some of these and move on to the next segment. Now, uh, Lionheart, if it'll focus correctly. Ah, there we go. Legacy of the Crusader. I can say that... Uh, hold on. Uh, is this one of the ones that I played... I want to say that, let's see, um, maybe, ah, here we go, Half-Life 2, come on, that's an instant classic right there, Star Trek DS9, Harbinger of Ho Halo, Hollow Sweet Missions, Scratches, which is a horror uh, PC game. Uh, I wonder if this one's FMV. Hold on. You know what? I want to say that it is. Or a point and click. Very fond of the point and click games. And here you have Monopoly. And of course, one of the Sims. Deluxe Edition. Not bad. And... Betrayal in uh, Anti Antira, which I believe is the second uh, the second series in the Betrayal uh, in the Betrayal line, a Sierra game, which is known for being cool. And here's some uh, Command and Conquer. Uh, followed by another one. And Dragon Lore 2. Which a uh, little advertisement there. But alright. Now, let's continue on. Ah, King's Quest. Mask of Eternity. Very nice game. This is one of the compilation CDs with uh, board games. You know, all that good stuff. Let's see here. What do we got here? Uh, the Wheel of Time. I don't believe I've tried this one yet. Maybe I haven't. Maybe I haven't. I don't know. Here is Empire Earth. Oh, I got this a while back. Ah, yes. Chess Master 6000. And, uh, here we go. Betrayal at Condor. Classic game. Great stuff. Another one of these uh, compilation CDs, which is cool. 
I know that uh, one of these compilation CDs, I got uh, John St. John to sign it. Ah, yes. If you don't have this one, then you are not a true PC gamer. Sherlock Holmes, Nemesis. Great game. All right, so this one is still sealed, which is, uh, let's see, what is that? Spiderwick, the Spiderwick Chronicles. All right, followed by one of my faves, Hunting Unlimited 2011. Come on, got to go for them bears, man. You got to go for those trophies. Big box. Aces, the complete collection. One of the uh, Sierra games, which is awesome. And that takes care of one section, and that's what's left. So let's continue on. All right, give me a sec. While I move these out of the way very carefully. Line it up like so. Okay. And let me try to uh, hold this in place. All right, hold on. Gonna have to turn here. All right, gonna switch hands. Age of Wonder. This is one of the first PC games that I ever bought and I love it. It's it's fantastic. It's uh it's like a strate uh strategic uh game. And uh yeah, I came across the demo on one of the Max uh PC Max uh demo discs and uh yeah, this is uh this is up there with my with my top 20. Dungeon Lore, or Dungeon Lords, I should say. Uh, collector's Edition. Yeah. Fantastic. Fantastic game. Here's uh, Disciples 2 Gold, another fantastic game. And Pool of Radiance, which is a Dungeons and Dragons wet dream. <laughs> Ooh, I made it not safe for work. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and uh, here we go. This is, uh, you can't go wrong with Knights of the Old Republic. Come on. Fantastic game. I'm going to keep saying that. These are all good games. I haven't come across one that I didn't like. And here's Trophy Hunter. Which is, you know, if it has bears and hunting, I'm all for it. Uh, I will hunt bears virtually. Aha. Uh -huh. Warcraft 3. Re Reign of Chaos. Yeah. All right. And this is one of my discs for uh, Wing Commander Prophecy, which is probably in here somewhere. The uh, expansion for StarCraft II, uh, Brood War, I think it says. All right. Beyond Atlantis. And, ah, yes. Uh, Shadow of Destiny. Which I think is a... Hold on a second. Okay. All right. This is a double pack, which uh, is uh, Chugo uh, Mobile Armor Division. You may notice that the art is from. Uh, oh, geez. Uh, I want to say uh, Masami Yung uh, Shiro. 
I, I want to beat this game so bad. I've got really far at the end, and I was completely stuck on one of their one of their dungeons. I'll need to figure it out sooner or later. But this is pretty awesome. This is one of the things where you can open it up and you get to see some of the some of the stuff here. Yeah, that's definitely uh, art from uh, the guy who created Ghost in the Shell. All right. Frank Herbert's Dune. A bit glitchy, but a proud addition to anyone's Dune collection. Let's see what else we got here. Ah, yes. Hello Kitty Dream Carnival. I got this because it was Hello Kitty, and why not? All right. Uh, Whiplash, a rather wacky racer, another disc from uh, Wing Commander Prophecy, ah, Nickelodeon Basketball, still haven't tried this one yet, could be hilarious, there are some games that uh, I have not, ah yes, check this one out, Clue Finders, Six Grade Adventures. Yeah, pretty fun stuff for the kitties. And uh, let's see here. Seven Kingdoms, which is, uh, I want to say, a strategic game. It's not that bad. What else do we got here? Ah, uh, yes. One more for the Wing Commander Prophecy. Followed by, ah, here we go. A true classic. Monkey Island Madness. Oh, yeah. A LucasArts game. You can tell that's one of the good ones. And here's another... Uh, let's see here. Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic, The Sith Lords, Disc 1. All right. And a classic uh, Batman game, which some of you may or may not know about. It's more or less like a interaction uh type deal so this is uh definitely something that you know what whenever whenever uh oh geez what is the name of that uh what is it you know what uh i'm trying to think what's in what is the name of that online event i should know this and i'm blanking on it uh but I should definitely stream this when that event happens. It's it's like something about like raising money for uh for kids. It's a perfect game to stream. All right. Oh wait a minute. So, uh, Ring Two. Uh, which is I guess Twilight of Twilight of the Gods. Uh, I'm not sure if I played this one before. Don't know. Seems cool. I like the armor. Yeah. There's a nice little creature there. That uh, looks pretty badass, actually. Yeah. Aha. And here we go. Signed by John St. John himself. The the Game Pack VGA games. Because uh, I saw in here, there's a funny story. They have Duke Nukem 2. And uh, he was like, oh, that's one of the ones that I was not a part of. That's before my time. And then he asked me, oh, do you want me to sign it anyway? I was like, hell yeah, man. Awesome. So I'm going to put these over here since I'm running out of space. Over here is Shivers. Another uh, Shivers 2. Another horror type game for your PC. I think this may be the only Warhammer game that I have in my collection. Dark Omen. I beat it fun game it's uh it deals with like skeletons and and dwarves and all kinds of chaotic goodness uh the great empires collection 2 so this is 
strategy game, I believe. I collect these things, and it's like, some of these ones I... I uh, another one of these compilation games, compilation CDs, with a whole boatload of uh, games to it. You know, it's often it's often very cool to get some of these compilations because you never know. You know, you might find something very very nice within the uh, intricacies of the CD. Oh yeah, Mist, fan fantastic, definitely a fantastic game. Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Rings, very nice game. And here we go. Police Squad, SWAT, another Sierra game. Got to represent with these pointed clicks. Can't, uh, can't sleep on it. So let me just put these games back in the case. All right, and I think, okay, all right, I think I'm going to put them in the right way. Did I put them in the wrong way? Hold on a second. Uh, I've got some space here. Okay. So let me see if I can... Somehow I had this working right. Okay. Uh, hold on a second. Can I put it in like that? No. Well, you know what? There we go. Alright. I'm about halfway through what's left. So let me maneuver this big boy over here. World, one of the more uh, wacky and uh, hilarious games for PC, Abe's Odyssey. All right, Rebels Prison Escape, a uh, a game about Dracula, the last. Uh, Sanctuary, I think, or last, uh, whatever that says. Okay, this is, uh, The Fallen. Another game from Star Trek, uh, Deep Space Nine. The Game of Life. Yeah. And, uh, Knox. And this... While not a game, well, not really a game, a rather interesting uh, addition to the Droid Developers Kit for your uh, for your Droid Lego Droid, which is there's some fun stuff in here. Not really a game, but it's cool. Here we go. Uh, Star Wars Jedi Knights: Mysteries of the Sith Expansion Companion uh, Missions. All right. Indiana Jones and the Emperor's Tomb. Time Commando. Uh, let's see here. What is this one? Uh, Mara, Mara Hound 2. Uh, whatever that says. Right, and here's a Navy SEALs game, which is pretty cool. Ah, Steel Sealed, Missile Command. And here we go. Another Star Wars game. Force Command. Force Commander, I should say. Here you have Storybook Weaver Deluxe. And... Uh, Hunterlands, Hunterland, Orc, Orc Lords, which could be, 
Uh, wait a minute. Let's see here. Oh, yeah. This is definitely one of the ones that I've played before. Yeah, this one's fun. Okay. Now you see we got a couple of, uh, a couple of stuff. I'm just going to grab it. Grab it at random. Here's Medieval 2, Total War. Here is Dungeons and Dragons, Dragon Shard, or Shard, another one of the uh, classic Dungeons and Dragons uh, games. Here we go. Uh, Spell Force 2, Shadow Wars. There you have a look at an elf who's rather uh, in your face. Yep, all kinds of strategic uh, goodness. All right. And Knights of Bounty, or King's Bounty, I should say, the legend. All right, a world full of adventure. All right. Rifts, which uh, I'm not sure if this one... If this is one of the ones where I can't play it because it's online only, but uh, yeah, could be the could be the uh, the situation with this. All right, and I'll grab two here. Lords of Magic, classic. This is a special edition. Roller Coaster Tycoon Three. Which uh, now ride the rides. That's that was their big uh, their big thing about that one. All right, Dungeon Siege, Legend of Arana. Full expansion includes the full version of Dungeon Siege. Okay. Uh, let's see what else I have here. All right, one of the Riz Wizardry uh, 8, another one of the Wizardry 8, and another one of the Wizardry 8. I think that's all three. Ah, uh, yes. Hard Truck 2, Truck Simulator. I love big rigs, so uh, this is uh, very cool. Look at that. 3D truck at its best with now big rigs. Hell yeah. All right. And here we go. Boulder's Gate 2. Ah, uh, yes. And here is my other uh, CD for the CSI, uh, CSI games. The first one. And Dark Motives. I'm going to set this one aside. Because I want to play that again. And this one I found at a thrift shop. I figured, eh, it's pretty cute. You know, maybe my niece will like it. So, uh, this is one of the Disney games. Alright. We are at the last box. Can you believe it, people? We are at the last one. Alright. Alright. All right, here we have the expansion for uh, Diablo 2, Lord of uh, Destruction, the one that where you deal with Bale. Definitely play this. I'm not sure if it's my second one, but it's the one with the case. Oregon Trail version 4.0. This is another one that I was not able to... Uh, get to work correctly, but I have it anyway. The Amazon Trail 2, which is a fun uh, adventure of the Amazon rainforest. One of the Jimmy Neutron games from Nickelodeon, which is all kinds of fun. And Star Trek Voyager Elite Force. 
which is uh, pretty freaking cool. All right, and here is, uh, I think that says Tra Traders Gate 2. I don't know much about this one, but I guess it's like their answer to uh, Tomb Raider, so I suppose. A new terrorist threat lies buried. All right. And the first Templar. I tried a little bit of it. Seemed pretty decent. Ah, here we go. Yeah, Bioshock. Awesome. Legends of Might and Magic. Explore Yellowstone. Another one from uh, the company that made Oregon Trail. Maya Quest. The Mystery Trail from the same guys. And uh, I Spy Mystery from uh, uh, Scaleric. I think this is one of these uh, where you got to find like the, um, the clues hidden in the pictures. One of those. Here we go. Divine Divinity. Oh, yeah. Perfect. This is, this is everything I ever wanted in a PC RPG game. It's a blend of everything that's good. Awesome. I'm going to set that aside, too. And here's another one of these compilation uh, CDs. And there's King Quest V. And that's it. That's, uh, those are all my games. About 95% of it, because I know the other, uh, the other Oregon Trails, like version 2 and version 1. I didn't see them here, but you got these two here. All that stack right there. Everything that's in here. The stack right here. Small stack over here. This, which these bad, bad boys go into that box. In here, these, and these. And there you have it. My Emporium of uh, PC random, PC retro goodness. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, yeah. I'm just a bear. Yeah, don't mess with me. All right, so thank you all for watching the video, and I'll talk to you later. Take care.